Bitwig Studio is a 64-bit application and it can run 32 and 64-bit plugins at the same time. In Bitwig Studio, plugins are part of the library which is constantly being monitored. As soon as you install a new plugin, it's immediately scanned in the background and shows up in the browser. This means you don't have to wait for your plugins to be scanned every time the application starts. Now let's take a look at a VST device. The device panel shows you a list of all existing parameters and a search field to navigate them quickly. Any parameter you touch in the plugin window gets automatically selected in the automation lane and therefore can be recorded immediately. The number of parameters you can automate is unlimited. Now I'm going to show you a feature that is not visible, but one of the main advantages of how Bitwig Studio handles VSTs. The plugin crash protection. You know how frustrating it is when a plugin misbehaves or crashes. Your music application crashes too, your workflow is interrupted and great ideas might be gone forever. In Bitwig Studio, you no longer have that problem. All plugins run independently from the application itself and when a plugin crashes, Bitwig Studio doesn't. To show you how that works, I'm going to simulate a plugin crash by killing the plugin process from the activity monitor window. The plugin crashed, but the rest of the song just carries on and now the panel shows your warning and a reload button. This also allows you to identify which plugins are causing problems. So I press the Reload Plugin button and... Hello, welcome back! The plugin is ready to roll again and you can continue making music in no time. Alright, thank you for watching and see you in the next beta video. Bye!